पुण्यभूषण फाउंडेशन त्रिदल पुणे आणि पुणेकरांच्या वतीने दिला जाणारा पुण्यभूषण पुरस्कार दोन हजार एकोणीस या वर्षी पुरातत्व तज्ज्ञ डॉक्टर गो ब देगलूरकर यांना उपराष्ट्रपती व्यंकय्या नायडू यांच्या हस्ते प्रदान करण्यात आला आहे यावेळी डॉक्टर शांब मुजुमदार चंदू बोर्डे डॉक्टर प्रभा अत्रे आदी मान्यवर उपस्थित होते हा पुरस्कार पुरातत्व शास्त्र क्षेत्रातील त्यांच्या अतुलनीय योगदानासाठी देण्यात आला आहे एक लाख रोख सन्मान चिन्ह पुणेरी पगडे असे या पुरस्काराचं स्वरूप आहे पुणे हे ऐतिहासिक सुंदर शहर आहे पुणे सांस्कृतिक केंद्र आहे पुणे हे समता आणि स्वातंत्र्य लढ्याचे केंद्र झाले असं सांगून उपराष्ट्रपतींनी इतिहासातील महनीय पुणेकरांच्या कर्तृत्वाला उजाळा दिलाय Thousand years back, he advocated end of untouchability. Even Adi Shankar. There are many social reformers who, some of whom I just uh, mentioned in the recent past also. So they will need to see that these small, small things that are happening in different parts, they should be curbed. And for that, there is a need to change the mindset of the people. Before we thinking of creating wealth, wealth is important. But health is much more important. That's why our forefathers have said that Arogya is Mahabhaji. Arogya is Mahabhaji. That's how they have explained. The lifestyle changes, the good habits that are taking place in the recent past, they are a matter of worrisome. We must get back to our lifestyle where there is some physical amount of physical exercise. There is to be some spiritual focus. And then food habits also time tested, season related food has been prescribed by our forefathers. You may be surprised why the vice president is talking about food. I am not prescribing any food code. Whatever food you want to eat, eat. <laughs> food has to be eaten in accordance with the season. What we say in our language, Rutu. But now because of the westernization, imitation of West and all, some of the younger generation, they are changing their food habits and tempting to go for pizza, burger and all, which are not suitable to our health. And they are, all, they are all saying, sir, now instant food, sir. Instant food means constant disease. This has to be. How can the food be instant? So you have to go back to your roots. And in that, the archaeology, plays an important role because it gives an insight to us 